Hello everybody, today, I mean today, we are going to be talking about Level Maker, a thing I've been thinking about it. So, Level Maker has all of these random people now, but it used to not be like that. It basically had like a power system where there were these people that are very popular. There are these people that you would see like, oh, look at this person. And then there are just people that filled the recent section with just random levels that you could play while waiting or you're bored. But now it's usually just those random levels users. But I've been thinking, the reason why is basically everybody takes inspiration off of another person on the app. So it's kind of like one big tree that I'll call the level maker tree. And the people that are on the top are like people like PCL or something. I don't know, just an example. And it just branches into different groups of people that take inspiration of those groups. And at the bottom is just those random people. So, basically, it's like the food chain. If one of those ones at the bottom disappears, probably, it doesn't really matter that much. Actually, no, it doesn't really. It's not that related to the food chain. It's just, if one of those... If one of those people at the bottom that nobody takes inspiration from just quits or something, it does nothing doesn't really happen because nobody takes inspiration off that person. Well, somebody at the top will take off an entire chunk of the community because they're like, oh no, this person quit? Well, I'm going to quit too. So that happened a few times, and it happened a lot. So basically, it also makes another thing, is that if an entire, if everybody that's at the top disappears, and only a few of them are left, they could rebuild the app, and they would be the most popular person again. It's probably a slow life cycle or something. I think that's going to happen next. So that's my talk about Level Maker. Goodbye.